Hi, this is Jody from Teachtopia TV with a brief tutorial on LibreOffice and specifically with LibreOffice how to save your document as a PDF. Now often you're going to find that saving your file as an open document format file or a um, Microsoft Word.doc file um, will do just fine or even an RTF. Um, but sometimes you'll need to save it as a PDF. Now why will you save it as a PDF? One of the um, main reasons um, for doing so is that when you send it to somebody um, it's very hard for them to edit and also if you know how they're going to view it um, pretty much um, Adobe has some standards set up and when you save it as a PDF it's pretty much like saving your file it capture it like almost as an image or it is an image for, for, for the most part and you know that whoever's going to view your PDF will see it as an image so a teacher for example might want to create a PDF of an assignment that they don't want um, students to manipulate or a professional might want to create a PDF that they don't want um, a client to manipulate. Um, and also you know that the, the margins, the display as a whole is going to be preserved. So let's go ahead and create a quick little document and then we'll show it as a how to save it as a PDF. So here we go. This is a document in LibreOffice and let me go ahead and make some text large or something like that so we can see how it, what, how it looks in. And let's bold it. All right, this is a document in LibreOffice. So here we go. Notice right here, export directly as PDF. If for some reason you did not have that icon showing your toolbars are manipulated or whatever, you can simply go File, Save As. And one of your many options was also going to be PDF, or maybe not. Okay, it looks to me that you are pretty much stuck with using the um, the icon there. So hopefully that icon remains. Okay, so we're clicking. Maybe there is a file export. Is there a there we go? File export as PDF. So you're either clicking on file export as PDF, or the PDF export directly as PDF icon here. So for some reason this isn't here, you're going to go file, export as PDF. Now quick note, once you save it as a PDF, that means your editing functionality changes as well too. So you probably want to save your file both as an, um, an open document format file or as a .doc with the save as and as a PDF. But if you want to save it, make sure you save it as both formats. If you know it's the PDF that you're not planning on manipulating in the future, then go ahead and just save it as a PDF. So here we go. Let's save it as a PDF. I'm going to call it PDF Sample. Let's save it on the desktop so we can view it in a second. PDF Sample. Okay. And now let's go ahead and open it. And let's see if we have a real standard PDF. And there it is. There is our PDF opened up in a rather modern version of Adobe Reader. This is a document in LibreOffice and of course we can now print it and if you were to send that as an attachment they would get it exactly as you see it now. Of course we're seeing it here at 59.4 percent. Here's your 100 percent version if you want to see that as well. Okay, so this was Jody from Teachtopia TV showing you how you could easily use the open source LibreOffice program to save a document as a PDF. Goodbye.